everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Omolola and this was my second trip to Hanoi. It was Sean's birthday. We went there to celebrate and ended up exploring more of Vietnam for a little over a week. We were also in Hanoi when Typhoon Yagi unfortunately hit. Please like and subscribe for more travel vlogs. We had just finished unpacking in our new apartment in Bangkok before heading out to the airport really early in the morning. landed in Hanoi and we're already really excited. We noticed that because we came in September there's a lot less just like foot traffic and so we're really excited to be exploring Hanoi outside of the high season. The last time we were here it was the high season so we just checked in. I'm really loving our hotel. I'm already excited to stay here. People are really nice and hospitable and now we're gonna go out and get some boon cha. I'm super excited. <laughs> I was probably in denial about it at first, but I definitely started having cold symptoms right at the start of my vacation, which was quite disappointing. 
but luckily I brought a little bit of Dayquil with me and I was feeling ready for our evening tour. We were going to be trying local draft beer. I'd had so so much fun the night before, but I'd woken up with a pretty bad hangover, and my cold had definitely gotten worse. I could only stomach a light breakfast, and then we headed out for a much calmer day.
think slowly but surely I am building my oh, Sean's ugly bag. It's always everywhere. <laughs> so I think slowly I'm building my like hot weather going out wardrobe. So this is the thinnest piece of fabric. It's this like pretty sage green, which I like. And I'm wearing it with a maxi, kind of like maxi midi skirt. And I'll just throw on a pair of sandals. So we, we should have quite a bit of rain tonight. We showed up in Hanoi and we realized that there was a typhoon passing through the area. And so we started to notice a little bit of rain. I hope that it's not as bad as um, a lot of us fear that is going to be. And in two days, I have my flight out of Hoi An. So even more, I don't want flights to be canceled. I don't want it to be too crazy. So tonight, we have dinner at this restaurant called Cloud Nine. I'm really excited. Um, I haven't really eaten anything since I had the fruits this morning. And so I wanted to make sure that I had at least some kind of an appetite for dinner. Super excited and I really like this outfit, okay? this year and it's all the way in September so I'm guessing just between moving and literally always being busy every day since we moved into our new apartment maybe it's stress <laughs> I don't know what happened but um, I'm really grateful that we were able to find cold medicine for really cheap for four dollars and that's really been keeping me going um, nothing like a cold to remind you of how much you've taken your good health for granted and I always tell myself I'll never do it again but <laughs> I mean, you know, I don't feel 100% quite yet, but I'm happy about this evening and I'm looking forward to making the best of this trip. Lipstick. It was Sean's birthday. The rain had just started and I was honestly getting mixed messages about exactly how the typhoon would impact Hanoi. We had breakfast at the hotel and figured out some new plans for the day. Happy birthday, happy birthday, 
downstairs in the hotel and so we're gonna have a one hour full body massage with an oil and then a 30 minute foot massage today is our last full day in Hanoi and even though I kind of wish I got to go out and explore today I realized that since now we're staying in Thailand we can always come back since we're not going out this morning I could do a little haul of what I got at tired city yesterday I'm really excited okay I got six t-shirts at Tired City yesterday because they're doing this deal where you buy four and you get two free. Here is my little mini Tired City haul. Thank you. 
massive meal and I went downstairs and got another cocktail. But I, I will not get drunk, so I'm not hungover tomorrow. So tonight is officially our last night in Hanoi. Um, unfortunately, we couldn't explore much because of the typhoon, but super grateful for the time that we spent here. And because we're still in Thailand, we can still come back whenever we want to. So tomorrow we have our flight to Hoi An, which we have never been to before. Um, so super excited and i'm sad to be checking out of this hotel it's been so nice the staff is absolutely phenomenal i cannot recommend it enough um but yeah it's just been a nice day sean had a good birthday and so i'm, I'm really happy i'm either going to sleep or order more food so <laughs> depending on what i decide um bye <laughs> I woke up and quickly learned about just how badly the typhoon had hit. The city would go on to have the biggest flood in two decades, and they're still dealing with the impact today. Yes, I had to cancel vacation plans, but it's absolutely nothing compared with folks losing their homes and losing their lives. Our flight to Da Nang was thankfully not canceled, so we were able to get a grab and check out of the hotel. Okay, so here is a little preview of what to expect on my next vlog. I spent a few days in Hoi An and was able to do much much more so please don't miss that vlog. It was such a beautiful way to continue our second trip to Vietnam. Thank you so so much for watching. Bye!